Welcome to Max Mann's Applied Electronics, example number one. Okay, so here's the question. The power in watts in a circuit with a resistance in ohms varies according to P equals 36R divided by the quantity R plus 4 squared. Find the resistance that gives maximum power. All right, so we've got our, our formula in terms of power and resistance. Um, the equation is asking for the, or the problem is asking for the resistance that gives us the maximum power, so we're all set. Now, what we need to do is make sure when we, we take the derivative, we wanna take the derivative because we wanna be able to set that to zero, uh, set that instantaneous slope to zero because we know that that's gonna be where our max is in the equation. But the problem is, is this formula is in a fractional form and we need to make sure we do use the quotient rule when we take the derivative. And if you need to go back and review the quotient rule, go back and do that now. But the basic gist is you're gonna take the derivative of the numerator times the denominator, and then you're gonna subtract the derivative of the denominator times the numerator and then all of that is gonna be divided by the denominator squared. And so you can see I've done that right there at that first bullet point. Now the second bullet point, we're setting all of that equal to zero. And then from that point on, we're just doing algebra to simplify and work on solving for R. Okay, on this slide, we're continuing to work on solving our equation for R. And you can see all the steps here and all the algebra involved and where I basically get it all the way down to R equals four. So if R is equal to four ohms, we can put R back into the original formula and solve for P. We should get a 2.25 watts. And what I've done here is I've taken the original formula and put it into Desmos and plotted that curve, that red curve, or the red line or is the function of the equation. And then I plotted the points four comma, um, with R being four, and that gives us the 2.25, and that's graphically represented here. Uh, we can see that our slope, our max now is in fact at four ohms and 2.25 watts, and that at that point, the slope is zero. Uh, 